Good morning, my great friends. So I have awesome news, friends. Checks worth up to $1,600 will be going out today to millions of Americans. Our lawmakers in Congress are now considering a new relief plan that would provide every American with monthly stimulus payments until the end of this crisis. So friends, please make sure to stay tuned until the end of this video to learn how you can claim this extra stimulus money. Be sure to also share this video on social media and with your friends and family if they need more honest stimulus news. Let me close with this. And this is not hyperbole. The world is watching. Autocrats believe that the world is moving so rapidly that democracies cannot generate consensus quickly enough to get things done. Not a joke. I've had these, I've had hours and hours and hours of meetings and personal conversations with Xi Jinping. I spent more time with him, I believe, than any other world leader has when I was vice president and now on the phone. I've, every time he calls or we talk about this, an hour, it's a conversation between an hour and a half and two and a half hours. Not a joke. My word. But he doesn't think democracies can compete because they can't act quickly enough. In my, in my summit with Putin, Switzerland, they're betting democracies can't compete. We can't move quickly enough. I'm heading to the G20, came back from the G7. You know how they measure? They don't measure us based on. All right, my friends. So payments for Social Security beneficiaries will arrive this week with the new COLA adjusted increase that was announced at the beginning of 2022. So individuals who meet the established criteria should expect to receive the payment of $1,657 very soon. The first round of payments will go out on the second Wednesday of this month, and that date is March 9th, which is today. While beneficiaries of social service and supplemental security income will have their check on March 9th, those who receive supplemental security income benefits and for those who retired before 1997 do not fall into this group since they receive the money on the first day of the month, regardless of their date of birth. But for those born in the middle of the month from the 11th to the 20th, you will receive your payment on March 16th. And for those born at the end of the month from the 20th to 31st of the month can expect checks on March 23rd. The Senior Citizens League, which is a nonpartisan senior group, is pushing Congress to issue a fourth stimulus check of $1,400 to all Social Security recipients. The group's chairman, Rick Delaney, has sent several letters to congressional leaders calling for another round of stimulus checks for those on Social Security income. According to an update from the group, they have stated a $1,400 stimulus check for Social Security recipients could be a way to get an extra non-taxable income to them. When inflation began to surge, the Social Security Administration announced that beneficiaries will see an increase of 5.9% in benefits this year, which is the largest boost in nearly 40 years. According to many advocates for seniors, this would be the highest COLA that most beneficiaries living today have ever seen. But a high COLA means exceptionally high inflation is impacting consumers. Chairman Rick Delaney told CNN News, The Senior Citizens League has received many emails over the past month, with many retired and disabled senders describing the situation that they face as rapidly rising inflation makes it nearly impossible to pay the bills. Social Security Administration increased payments by an average of 1.4% over the past 12 years and 1.3% for the year 2021. In the past 21 years, COLAs have raised Social Security benefits by 55%, but housing costs rose nearly 118%, and healthcare costs rose by 145%, over that same period. The Senior Citizens Group said economic impact payments for eligible individuals on Social Security retirement income 
would help offset these costs. So my friends, do you agree that there should be a $1,400 stimulus check provided for Social Security recipients? Please leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Right now, Representative Ilhan Omar, along with other progressive Democratic lawmakers, have proposed legislation that would dole out regular stimulus checks, or so-called guaranteed income, through monthly payments of up to $1,200 for adults and $600 for children. The Minnesota Congresswoman has proposed a bill to her colleagues and said in a press release and a Twitter post about the proposed legislation, saying that poverty is a choice. Fellow Democratic Representatives Dwight Evans of Pennsylvania, Marie Newman of Illinois, and Jamal Bowman of New York also have endorsed the same bill. Representative Omar also said, For too long we have prioritized endless growth, while millions are homeless, hungry, or without health care. The crisis has laid bare these inequalities. We, as a nation, have the ability to make sure everyone has their basic needs, like food, housing, and health care met. Friends, the keyword for this video is lavender. If you would like to enter this coming Friday's Walmart gift card giveaway, please click and like my videos. Comment below this keyword and additional keywords from any video of mine that you watch. And please do make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. Omar has pointed to programs in various places across our country that have provided guaranteed income to millions of Americans. The Congresswoman argued that the United States should become the leader in measuring and safeguarding our people's economic well-being, stating that her legislation would be a start in that direction. The program would not immediately begin sending out $1,200 checks to Americans. Instead, it would create a $2.5 billion grant program to fund pilot guaranteed income programs across the United States. Then, the legislation would provide $1,200 per month to individuals making $75,000 or less per year. The heads of households with an income of up to $112,500 would receive $1,200 under this program, and $600 would be provided for each minor child. So my good friends, do you support this bill? Please let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me here this morning. I greatly appreciate all of you who are watching all of my videos. Please do me a big favor and share this video with your friends and family if they need more reliable and accurate stimulus news information. Thank you so much and have a wonderful and blessed Wednesday.